Hey, it's Sid with Table Talk with Sid again. This is a short life memo. I was uh, having a discussion with some friends the other day on how do you become who you're meant to be. And I just wanted to share this little bit of information with you to toss around. It's actually quite exciting because it's a new point of view about life. So regardless if you believe in life, God, or the universe... Before you came to this earth, envision yourself having a sit-down with them. They sat down with you. They discussed with you what makes you you, what makes you unique, what makes you this person that will make a difference on this earth, and all the things that will make you happy. And they contract with you, saying that as you're here on this earth, they will send you these contracts through ideas. So when you get these ideas, it's not just ideas that you're getting. They are actual contracts with God, life, and the universe on things that have already been discussed, things that have already been decided years ago, centuries ago, all the way back to the beginning of time on who and what you are and what makes you amazing. And all that's required of you is when you get that idea, that inspiration, If you can step forward with faith, gratitude, excitement, with grace, and do what you feel you could be doing or you should be doing or you want to be doing, when you step forward doing those things, even if it seems backwards, because life and society lives backwards. So going at life and trying to get the things you want out of life on the terms of how society thinks you should go about things is kind of a backwards way of living. So if you can get inspired, and even if it feels backwards, go do the things that are coming to you first, because that is life, God, and the universe talking directly to you about your gifts, your talents, and who you're meant to be, and the things that will uplift your life. And what is so amazing is that these inspirations, these ideas, these things that you may get in passing from someone. Someone may say something and it kind of triggers you like, wow, that's exciting. I never thought about that. Or maybe something comes to your mind that is so intoxicating to you and you can't stop thinking about it. It is because it's what's meant for you. It's the stuff that God, life, and the universe is contracting with you, and they are reminding you by sending it down, saying the time has come for you to step up, get excited, remember that you have important things to do here on this earth, to push forward with faith, inspiration, and to go after what you're meant to do, what you want to do, and what you're inspired to do. Remember in life, you will fall down, stand up, brush off, and move on. Talk to you.